Welcome back to Factorio, folks. We are joined, as always, by ST Hedgehog. Hello, hello, hello. And we are standing in weird stuff. Uh, we are trying to summon the Trank Kraken yeah, thing. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, essentially, we, we want to have two lines for our train. So um, instead of having just one line in and one line out, we're going to have two in and two out. Yep. As you can see here represented by these wonderful conveyor belts. Uh, and we were trying to figure out how to get a crossing working. And this is what we come up with. Yeah. And I don't know if it's a good idea or not, uh, but... <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. Kind of we've gone with. Um, I, I am thinking I need to change the sense a bit um, to be, like, instead of starting here and going up, it should start further back. Uh, Maybe so that it doesn't, so that the center piece doesn't get completely shut off. Yeah. Uh, if it starts further back, it would only technically turn off these three, and then the other side can work. So. Yeah. How about how about making the gap here uh, one wider, and the gap here in the in the center one wider, because then uh, we could do. I, I, yeah, I mean, I, I was going to look at doing something like um, uh, if we do that, then it won't be so congested in here. Yeah, I, I was thinking about doing something like that, putting the the crossing in there. Yeah, okay, that's so, a possibility uh, too. So when the crossing goes up, all it does is turn off this line and this line, and doesn't affect anything over on this side. Yeah, but I don't know whether that would work or not. Um. The other option is to just put a mini roundabout in the center. Yeah. Uh, that would still cause... That would still cause what, problems, what, right? What we need is we need a train. Yeah, we do. <laughs> uh, so a that couple we can, of trains. Yeah, so that we can just have them like loop around at the back and come back and forward and test what goes on with this. Yeah. Um, uh, or we need to ask the audience, find a friend. You know, yeah. Uh, find out whether they think this is any better or not because this is the best we could come up with essentially yeah it was and we tried a few different things so i i we, we tried this thing down here as well but that definitely oh yeah work. yeah yeah we we tried two roundabouts one inside the other as well previously which we don't yep. have here but um tried weird things like this uh i must admit i didn't actually go and look up anything afterwards i, I watched that video you sent me which had a couple of different rails in it yeah uh, and so one of them was uh, kind of like yours. Yes, yeah, but the centerpiece was very different to it, so that's why I want to spread it out a bit more, I think. So. Yeah. So. Yeah, so basically yeah. he hadn't done the crossing in the in the center there. Up here. He didn't have that at all. Yeah. Yeah, but then he had the trains go off somewhere else, turn around and come back again. So yeah. all trains would have to go through this twice, which is... Yeah, it's not, not practical. The idea. No. It's not practical. But I think, I think just moving them back, uh, one, two, three, maybe four. That wrong. Doing something like maybe that. Mm -hmm. Would work and then have them like cross on this bit here um yeah would work instead of all being the center like it is madness here yeah uh, i don't know but it's so it's, it's a work in progress but i don't think we're going to be getting to rails that soon certainly not this episode um, not as much as i want to yeah we're we're a bit off um we probably should go check out where the biters are so that we maybe can deal with them before the pollution hits and um, yeah so that was a suggestion from pete and unfortunately you saw my reply to him uh, i did <laughs> that wasn't I, intended i i i, I, I did um <laughs> uh, I, I i should go and be cannon fodder um and, uh, <laughs> Yeah, 
I'm I'm okay with that, but um, uh, also not. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So yeah, you don't want to be a guinea pig. I don't understand. <laughs> Completely forgotten where I was going to put. Was it there? Yeah, I don't know. I've I've broken this already. Okay. Uh, but what what would we do? Are we going to go in, 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 and and find the biters? Could we know where some copper is, and we can see some other iron? Yep, I I think what, we should go we should take be? a look at where the biters are. Yes, but before that, mm -hmm. I think we should set up a automated ammo thing if we haven't got one already. Yes, so I agree. I agree. Uh, that is a good idea, and maybe an automated uh, turret thing. Yes, yeah, that might not be a bad idea. Could we have steel so we can make the better ammo already? Yeah. Uh, you have steel? Uh, yeah, we're making steel. Steel is right here, on this line here. All right. Right, right, right. So that wherever we need it to go. Very good. Uh, I make some assembly machines. Need plates for that. So let's make uh, the piercing rounds magazines instead of the basic ones, right? Yeah, that would make sense. Uh, so let's uh, let, let's make that south. Uh, is there enough space? Yeah, there's enough space. Yeah, this isn't really very effective at the moment because obviously I'm stealing the iron plates for the steel, which I really shouldn't have done. I should have run it differently, but. Yeah, well. This is fine. This is fine. Uh, I shall go a little bit further across and uh, make the turret production. All right. Sounds good. I'll come over to say here somewhere. Uh, so what I need to make turret production. Let's actually do something, shall we? Oh, just iron gears. That's easy. I didn't want to drop you there. <clears throat> Mostly um, copper. We do this. Uh, that was not what I wanted to do. I want... You. Alright. So, that's four of those a second if we get the iron, which is questionable with the iron throughput that we have. Uh, It'll be fine. Yeah. Don't worry. Oops. Right. And output. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do that different. A splitter. Yeah, so oh. nearly uh, we may or may not have videos next week, right? Uh, yes, yeah, we we're both uh, are busy next weekend's record, so we're going to try and get stuff done today. Yeah, uh, which does mean that bear in mind if you do comment on today's episode, we can't address it for potentially six episodes because of how our recording works. Yeah, so. Uh, uh, I do know, uh, particularly Pete tends to comment on every episode, and it's like, oh, damn it, I really wish I could have known that for the next episode, but yeah, I'm not going to go three episodes with that, and it makes us look like we're annoying you. We're not annoying you. We're not at all. We take everything you say in because, uh, well, you know, you know what you're talking about. Yep. <laughs> exactly. We just make it up as we go. <laughs> <laughs> That's very true. Uh, fine. Uh, yeah, so we'll, we'll see. There might be some episodes missing, but, but, but we don't know yet. Yes. Yeah, it all depends on how today goes, doesn't it? Uh, yeah. Two a second. You need 
copper plate needs to be alone. That's that's gonna be one to one, isn't it? What am I doing? What am I doing? Actually, I want copper plate on the inside. So what we'll do is like that. We'll make it a little bit weird, but that's okay. It's just a starter base. That's what they always say. Yeah. There we go. Well, that's not going to work, is it? Alright, so if... How about we do take it? Three seconds to craft. So we put these take one second to craft, right? Yep. So we actually only need three of these. Oh, never mind. Um, oh, we actually only need three of these. So there. And nah. I'll turn into one of these. Okay. Uh, oh, I don't have any power cable left. Oh no. And then we need a splitter here. This needs to go underground. Like that. And then we have what we need. You don't go there though. You go. Let's just put it there. And you make those. This is going to be very slow doing this, but it's, it's going to do it regardless. Uh, it's better than nothing. That is true. The fast be better. And we need a chest. And there we go. We have. Uh, I'm. I'm just gonna leave that wooden chest completely filler upable. Yeah. I think that's exactly. reasonable, and I'm doing the same with the steel chest for, uh... oh, no wait, I need three of these, don't I? Yeah, I need three of these. I need three of these. Oh, I haven't even looked at the ratios properly. Uh, I think it's one to one, if, I, if my memory was correct. It might be less than that. I don't know, because this uses eight, 10 and 8 seconds. This produces 20 and 10 seconds, I think. so. Okay. I think it's practically one-to-one. -one. Yeah, probably. There, where's our chest? Oh, I'll do this instead. There. Let's do some power pulls. No, let's first get... Outputs. Then we can do power poles. This is gonna drive you crazy, but oh, I've given up. <laughs> All right, so what's that? Am I brain completely shut down? I, I, I think my brain is completely shut down. I can't speak. I can't calculate. Well, well, you're speaking, but then I'm not sure you need a brain to speak because I've heard politicians speak. So. Yeah, that's true. That's true. So these produce one every second. Uh, these guys up here. 
And these need one every three seconds. Oh, oh, uh, are you trying to apply maths this early in the morning? Uh, yes, I am. I don't know what time it is for you, but it's yeah. it's uh, uh, it's five thirty. Four, it's four thirty in the afternoon for me. So uh, it's, fate, well, it's way too early. Way yeah. too early for math. That's true. How much is it? They they take three seconds. So uh, there should be nine mm -hmm. of these, shouldn't there? Or those three? It, it should be one to three. Yeah. Yeah. I don't have that many assemblers. I don't think we need, I think we need that much ammo right now. No, probably um, not. <clears throat> we we will we will obviously expand out and get things going as we go, but yeah. Yeah. What we need is just make sure we do as much military science as possible. Maybe even get a car. I don't know how cars would react right now. Uh, I have uh, <clears throat> I've queued up cars. Ah. Uh -huh. And we definitely need a Spidertron at some point. Uh, yes, no doubt about that. Because <laughs> they look awesome. Right, I'm going to steal 15 ammo. Put in my gun. All right. Just remove you. Remove you. Okay, so uh, where do you want to look for bites first? Uh, that's a very good question. Uh, let, let me just queue up some research here so that we have something going while we're gone. There. Okay. Uh, shall, shall we go north or shall we go... 41 magazines. Is that enough? I don't know. 73. That's enough. Uh, uh, I've got 15. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to take, take 10 turrets when another one gets made. Oh, grab 9. Now there's 10 left. Uh, wait, what now? I took nine of the oh. turrets. Oh, no, 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 it's all right. I already had some on me. Oh, okay. It's all right. I, I, picked up, I picked up 12 and went, I've now got 15. Hang on a minute. That's not right. I don't know how far my 15 ammo is going to take me, but... Not very far. 22. That'll do. I can take on the world with 22. All right. Let's go check it. Uh, which way do let's, you want to go? go? I'm going to go up to the oil and start from there. All right. Oh, there's oil there, yeah. Uh, so I guess we should go where the the pollution is spreading. Really? Uh, uh, where is the pollution spreading? Uh, oh yeah, so probably over there. Not a bad idea. That that's uh, another thing that I didn't realize. Obviously, I've turned all the trees off. Well, not all of them off. Turned a lot of them off. Yeah. And trees obviously eat pollution. Yeah. Oh. We should have made some armor. I didn't make armor. Did you, do you have armor? Maybe, I, I do not know. Maybe we should have made a, a lived on a forest world. Like the uh, the forest world of Endor. Yeah, maybe. Go go find the Ewoks. Oh. Yep. That. I don't think the Come Ewoks on. would appreciate shade us uh, hand grenading all their that, trees either, though. That would be a fantastic mod. To replace the buyers with Ewoks. Yeah. <laughs> that, that would be kind of funny. <laughs> okay, so there's no pollution over here. No. But where are the closest spiders? I don't know. I'm, I'm just going to follow the coast for a bit and see. Right, I'll go out a little bit and see. Where are the there are some rocks. There are rocks. I yeah. see some rocks. Man, the closest spiders are far, far away. They they are definitely turned on. Oh, there they definitely. are. Are you fancy? Yeah. Ah. Jesus, that's a big nest. Yes. Yeah. I I changed him to have. Large nests, but they only evolve when we shoot them, or they have pollution. Yeah, they don't evolve over time. But uh, I don't think we'll survive attacking these guys right now. No. Look at all those spitters. 
They should uh There's another pack down there. Yep. But providing the pollution doesn't come out here, they should be okay. Yeah. Should we just try and, and do a quick run around the entire base and see where where, where they are so that we can see where uh, yeah. our pollution is relative to them? Yeah, yeah, we'll just map out a large area around the base and see what's what. Yeah. I'm going to... Are you going around that's them? That's a big maybe? base, man. I'm going to run over and map this area over here. Yeah. So, yeah, when, when it comes to conquering the buyers, we're definitely going to need some form of strategy. Oh, yeah. Most decidedly, there's iron over here under the biter base. Awesome. Just where we need it. Yep. Oh, I found green. I found, I found tamarium. Oh, no, sorry. It's, it's uranium. Oh, cool. That was when I, when I was looking through the mods. Uh, some, somebody asked about um, uh, playing a modded playthrough. And uh, yep. we were going to add mods to this. And uh, I had difficulty getting them working on the server. Um, probably because I don't know what I'm doing, basically, and was... Makeup. And I left it way too late to try and figure it out. <laughs> so uh, we had to kind of just get going. Um, but I did see there is a Tiberium mod, which I thought was quite cool. It, it just it replaces all the ores with Tiberium. Okay. You just break down Tiberium into, you know, you, you have your assemblers can break it down into iron or copper or whatever. Oh, cool. Because uh, that's what Tiberium is. But Tiberium hurts you when you walk on it, which I thought was really cool. It's like a proper Commander Conquer. Yeah. Clean. Yeah, that is pretty cool. And there are a lot of trees just down a, there. Just need, need a a complete command and conquer conversion. Yeah. Factory. Well, that could be kind of fun. Yeah. Get some harvesters. You know, go out and mine some to bring yourself nearly dying. And then build some harvesters and get them doing stuff. Yeah. Uh, there there are also uh the two very, very popular Angels mods and Bob's mods? Ah, uh, Bob's mods, yes. Yeah. Um, I don't know whether they just... Uh, they, they... I was going to say they overcomplicate stuff, but they, they just change everything, don't they? They overcomplicate... Yeah. They overcomplicate they complicate stuff to bring more things to the game. Yeah. So. And it does get very complicated with them. Very, very complicated. Don't see any other boy down here for the moment. Oh, you found some. Yep. Jesus, the buyers of batter bases are big. <laughs> It'd be fine. It'd be fine. How are we supposed to kill this? I found some more. Um, with talent well then we're screwed <laughs> uh, oh yeah I forgot about it <laughs> <laughs> uh, blind luck <laughs> yeah 64 million iron ore here oh it's a pretty good number how the hell am I anyway Oh, another here. Over here. Hello, biters. How are you today? Looking friendly as ever. Oh, God. Oh, God. Did you attack them? No. Did you I'm walk dead. too close to I'm them? I'm so dead. Yeah, I walked too close to them. I am so dead. Yeah, you died. Oh, dear. First oh, dear. death. Oh, dear. First death. Oh, dear. But it was a death to a train. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. And I killed some of them. So. Good job. You, you know. pissed them off. <laughs> yes. 
Have it, Vitus, have it. I'm not afraid of you. There's a big pond down here. Oh, and a big biter base. This maybe isn't the most exciting episode to watch us just running around, but it needs to be done. Yes, yeah, we've got to kind of look, see what's what and what's where. Maybe we should have waited for the cars driven them around. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> oh, well, oh, well, where is my body? Body stand there. Can I make a machine gun? No. No gears. Oh, there's a big biter base here as well. Okay. Please kind of me around my body. We kind of found the edges. Southeast and west, right? Yeah. Uh, so let's find them north as well. Go up here and uh... there's a big, beautiful iron ore patch. It really is 64 million. Full of healthy, healthy iron. Mm. And it's spider free for now. That is true. But if we decide to build down there and start mining it, then it won't be spider free because then they will get a little bit upset. I found a bit of stone. Okay. 10 million stone. That'll do for a bit. Yeah, that's, that's just generally how this map's going to be. It's going to be large amounts spread out quite far. Yeah. Um, which really adds to the whole we need trains to transport stuff around. Yeah. Which is kind of the whole point. <laughs> it is. It is. Oh, oh, I found a bit of coal too. Oh, cool. A large bit of coal. I'm going to go up this way. Check north. See where the closest biters are. Ah, oh, so it's, it's lakes. We have lakes next door to us. We don't actually have a large ocean. Oh, okay. But it, looks bit, it looks as if it's just a lake. Cool. Uh, I think... I might be wrong. Yeah. No, I might be wrong. It might actually be a... It's larger than that. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, found uh, 31 million coal. All right. That's just the other side of this uh, massive water. Yeah. It may or may not be a lake in disguise. I don't know. Very nice. And I wish I had my legs, my exoskeleton. <laughs> I was going to say, what happened to your legs? <laughs> <laughs> Did you get too close to the biters too? Forty four million copper on top of a ba uh, biter base and okay. sixteen million more iron. Nice. Let's go check this and see. Uh, it seems like this is cut off, but I am not sure. Even more biter bases. Yeah, so we've uh, we've scoped out an area. Yeah, quite a large area, actually, which is nice. On the wrong side of the water. Uh, you have a long run run home, if you have to go all the way around that. Uh potentially, yeah. Um, but uh, I will have to do that, I suppose, between episodes. Because uh, yeah, we are out of time. You never, you, you never guess what happened. <laughs> <laughs> we, we're out of time. 
yet again yeah, at a time so uh yeah we've been wandering around and not doing a great deal and uh it's not been an exciting episode i'm really sorry for that but yeah it needed to be done yeah we need to explore yeah we need to look can i build a car yeah building a car would probably be a good idea pretty soon but now we know so so I, we don't need it right now I, Still playing an engine unit. I can't build an engine unit because it needs an assembler. Damn. Well, there's a lot of trees up north here, so they will help with the pollution. He left completely alone and not touched ever. That's I should have just made the map for the trees. I, I should have just done that. I should have just made the whole thing completely 100% for the trees. Oh, that would be a, a forest pain. Wall. That would be a pain. And and then and then ban the use of grenades. <laughs> <laughs> that, that would be an absolutely horrible factorial playthrough, <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> you know that chop down trees? No, nope. you gotta work around them. That would be Oh that that was would just be pure punishment. Pure punishment. Anyway, we are out of time, so shall we call it? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to carry on wandering around and hopefully I'll find my way back home again. Yep. Hopefully. All right. Okay. Thank you very much for watching, guys. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Have fun.